already. This is how we roll, people. <laughs> oh my gosh. Now, now you have to pick it up. Now I gotta pray that it's all here. Lex is making it rain. <laughs> this is all her coffee shop money. Don't think she's doing anything naughty, people. <laughs> <laughs> she's only 14. Not even yet. I think it's like, I have like 50 something. Like a month. Or no, 40. I think I have like 48. I'm going to save it till after my birthday and Christmas and add it all up. Her birthday and Christmas are three days apart, so she usually cashes in at the end of the year. When all like my you... clothes don't fit anymore. Perfect. <laughs> she needs jeans, and she colored on. <laughs> I wrote on my jeans. Uh, I'm going to show you guys my green eyeliner today. What do you think? I'm trying to be bold. Bye. Match my green shirt. This is going to be our family chore chart. Brad snagged this for me from one of the classrooms. And then this whole hallway is going to get decorated. You will see transformation. Probably not all today, but you'll see it. But right now I'm going to paint it with black chalkboard paint because I don't really like the green. You want some lipstick? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Touch of spice. Oh, pretty. <laughs> Train him young. Um, we are going to dinner. And. Hungry. Are you hungry? Okay, let's go. Okay. Right here. Right here. I want to show Ezra my little hipster baby. And Brad's beautiful hair. Oh, you can't really see. My mother-in-law made him a bibdana. Look at how cute he looks. You can't really see. Oh, let's get him in better light. Okay, let's go. This is how I'm he's been. I'm finishing watching this. All day. Ooh, snotty. Yeah. Except a Except a bowl of top ramen, a smoothie, some cereal. Don't sit there. Don't sit there, please. Except for all breakfast. the other snacks. I missed one meal and I'm dying, no. but I got lunch and snacks. I never had a snack. I had lunch. I had a little thing of top ramen. It wasn't even a whole bowl. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, he's still in. Okay, let's go. I any snacks. I made you a smoothie with protein powder in it. That should have filled you up. That was nasty. Whatever, no, was it? Not the smoothie part is good, but that thing in the emergency is nasty. You can't eat that, Aubrey. You poop enough. That's fiber one. They're fiber one bars. <laughs> to help mommy out. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. We gotta go. We gotta go. Hey, this, is is this is real life. This is if this no, is our real life right here. Let's go to bath. See if I can make it. Oh, not even close. <laughs> Let's try it one more time. That was a split shot. Yeah. One more time, one more time. Oh. oh. Mommy, mom's stinks. a bad shot. There, right there, and then. Okay, but you gotta come back to this chair right here. Okay. Yeah. 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 And you're gonna make it in that thing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> You stink. I tried three times to make it and he made it in the first one. First time. <laughs> Not Let me hear you. Look at me. Oh, I'm in the way. My shadow's in the way. 
Look at this cute little bib Deanna. My mother-in-law made, so now I know she could do it, and we're gonna have lots of them. I want some Christmas ones. She printed out the pattern though, so maybe I could try. I can, so I just haven't done it in a while, so I don't know how good I am anymore. <laughs> yeah, this is the pattern. I'm really not sure how it goes. This is our fabric we used. Cute, huh? She just did it with Velcro in the back. And look, Brad's back at it. Marathon. Veteran Day, Law and Order Marathon Day. I like Criminal Minds too. I haven't watched Law and Order in a while. I want to start watching Chicago PD. Is that what it's called? If you any of you watch it, let us know how you like it. And I'm gonna wake up this baby and feed him before everybody else gets home from Dina. He chats with Mandy. That's what I'll call these. No, I'm just joking. Um, yesterday I went to the doctor because I shared in a vlog that I'm just not feeling right. Um, don't feel like I'm healing right. My blood pressure is still high. You know, blah blah blah. So I went to the doctor. I was there for an hour and a half. Well, I was there for two hours really. But an hour and a half, I'm just waiting. And then they took my blood pressure. It was 150 over 110. Then they waited a few minutes to get it again. It was like 130 over 95. It went down, but not like significantly. And then the final one was like 130 over, I think, 94 or something like that. And um, I got to just relay messages to the doctor through the... She's not even in... I don't know what they're called. She's not a nurse. She can't do anything, but she's like the one who takes your vitals. And even she was getting frustrated saying, I just wish she would come out here and talk to you. Um, but I was saying that my blood pressure obviously is still high and this is with taking medication, so it's not working. Um, can we change it to something else or whatever? And they're like, well, no, you're okay, <laughs> which I'm not, but you're okay. Just watch out for headaches. I'm like, well, I've had a headache for like last month every day. Um, I'm like, well, then it's just side effects from your medication. If it's happening right when you take it, I'm like, it's not. It's happening like a good. I take my medication when I wake up and when I go to bed. So my headaches are usually start about two o'clock in the afternoon. And they're pretty bad. And so that's nowhere near when I take my medication. And so this is going back and forth, back and forth. And I'm getting more and more frustrated. Like, just come out here and talk to me. And at the end of it all, it was, go see your primary care doctor, because you're no longer in our care, because you've had the baby. But P.S., I haven't had my postpartum check at all, so I'm not out of their care yet. I still have another time I need to see them. So then I called my primary care doctor to try to get in to get my medication changed, because 150 over 110 is not abnormal. Like, that's kind of what I've been getting at home with my blood pressure cuff, cuff, um, so this is kind of like where my blood pressure is, and that's really high. Um, so I call them. Well, my primary care doctor is out till Thursday, and she can't. She doesn't have any available appointments till the 25th of November. And yesterday was the 10th. <laughs> so, yep, that's where I am, guys. I'm got extremely high blood pressure. Have nobody to help me, and my prescription ran out today. Um, hopefully they'll refill it for me at the OB because they're the ones who prescribed it. So I have that all called in and supposed to be taken care of by tomorrow. But this prescription isn't helping, so I don't know what to do. Um, in the meantime, I'm tired and I have a headache all the time. And I am concerned because um, my stepmom actually just had a heart attack probably like four months ago. And her blood pressure was one. 30 over 100 or something like that and mine's higher than that and they're not wanting to do anything about it so yep my mom and my mother-in-law said I should go to urgent care the urgent cares here are the same thing they'll tell me to go see my primary care doctor and I already have an appointment with her so I'll just hang out till then just dumb I, and my pain has I don't know if I've just gotten used to it or if it's getting better um, probably a little bit of both. Um, I'm trying to drive, as you saw probably in one of these vlogs. Um, and I'm sore afterwards, and it's hard. 
because it's my right side that hurts the worst and that's the foot and all that that I'm using so yeah I don't know I'm falling apart and nobody cares well the medical care here doesn't care no care in the medical care but that's where we're at right now lame really lame because I need to be firing out my mother-in-law ended up staying a whole nother week because she could tell that I was not ready yet and um, I didn't say anything I, I was actually like no go ahead and go I'll be okay but in the inside I was kind of like yes thank you because <laughs> yeah, I'm not ready yet I'm not better yet and so she's staying a whole nother week and she's gonna drive up with us when we drive up when to go work and meet some of the family up there so that's what's going on right now guys do you like my chair I should do this up a little bit better in this corner since this is all you've been seeing for the last month and I promise vlogs will get more on a regular like daily schedule here um, but still we've had tons of company and just all that stuff and it's just kind of weird to pull out a camera and be like hey you wanna be in my vlog um, cuz I'm still not all the way comfortable with it yet I'm sure family isn't gonna be like oh yeah <laughs> so it'll get better it'll get normal here in a little bit we'll talk to you guys later he was just smiling so big nice full tummy nice full tummy <laughs> Sweet baby. Give me a smile again, mister. I wonder what babies dream about. Give me a smile. Come on. You could be the thumbnail if you smile. <laughs> you are so sweet. I couldn't love you more if I tried. No. <laughs> Precious, oh my gosh. I'm sorry if you get annoyed with baby footage, but holy cow, I don't even care. This is for us anyway. <laughs> All right. <laughs> seriously what I do all day is just stare at him anyway so if you want to know what I do during the day that's it right there stare at Ezra stare at him and then feed him change his poop listen to Aubrey scream try to balance it all but sweet baby faces like that just makes it all worth it huh Alright guys, I am going to properly end this vlog by saying like, subscribe, comment. Um, if you know any foods or anything like that that helps high blood pressure naturally, let me know because I'm going to you know, try to be doing that kind of stuff until this all gets taken care of. Um, and yeah, give me some suggestions of how to live life with 202 and whatever else. So yeah, like, subscribe. Subscribe if you want to see the crazy family every day. Well, almost every day. Every day after the next couple weeks. <laughs> so, yes. We'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for all your support and love and patience with us. And we'll see you later. Bye!